I'm telling you, the folks are not playing today. What's going on? It's Glendon. And today we're going to be talking about zero to one million dollars. How to have that good life, how to enjoy yourself and where it all started. First thing, this is a community supported project. There are no ads, so we need that super chat action going on. And if you catch the replay, you can also go below, hit the super chat, let's say super chat that and make your donation by PayPal to support the community. So I appreciate you guys. All right, so this whole show is gonna be about the new course, zero to $1 million. The link is below. Early bird special, 300, you get to use the coupon so you can get it for 150. Uh, that's going to be in effect until I get the bones of the stuff all situated. Now, one of the things that we need to have a greater understanding on is you must stop looking for simple, easy solutions to very complex problems. If you're at the age of 24 to 35, you don't have any money, you don't have a lot of money, or every few months you like tweaking out, you're not going to change that process overnight. So if you're looking for some very quick solutions because your life is on fire, everything is jacked up, you can leave this video. I don't have anything for you. But if you're looking to have a much better life this time next year, some of you will get it sooner, then stay tuned. All right, so let's get into this. Let's talk about how to make money in 2020, regardless of a recession with your business model and advanced hustle. One of the things that happens during a recession is things slow down, but the companies that keep marketing, the companies that keep pushing do well. I've weathered four recessions. Uh, the first three, I had a job. And the last one, I had a business and my business grew. And I fully expect that to happen this time. So what I've done because there's been a lot of people who've been asking, hey, how can I join H undergrad? How can I get into that? How can I start making money? First of all, you got to get the mental foundation to building up your business. That is a critical, critical component to being successful with your business model or advanced hustle. I've got the data. I've looked at it. The people who've done the best with my courses already had the right mindset. So there are many folks here who are looking for a personal guarantee. And I can give you one. If you do the work, if you're not a yard bird, if you apply yourself, you'll make money. I can guarantee you that. So there's your guarantee. But the thing is, are you going to hold up your end of the bargain? Because this is, you know, everybody wants to make that Wi-Fi money without really doing too much. And you're going to have to do some stuff with H undergrad. You're going to have to go ahead and put yourself in the driver's seat of success. Now, one of the things that I'm doing a little different. So let me go ahead and set this up. What I've done is you're going to get the courses. It's kind of like a car deal. You know, you get to drive the car for a little money down and you get to enjoy the car while you pay for it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to offer you two versions of H undergrad. First of all, you're going to get these access to the courses, plus I'm going, the courses are arranged in the order that you should take them. 
but you'll have full access to them. So the first one is Hustler Undergrad Basics. It includes the pre-purchase of the courses for $99 per month for 20 months. And H Undergrad Premium is $200 per month, which will include live training once a month. So that's your two ways to get in. So what we're going to do is, and the way that I set this up is, it makes sense. First of all, you know, you can get the Hustle Mindset, Pip Your Mind for Success book to tune you up. That's part of the course. You can go below the video and get it for free. The Hustle of Mindset, Pip Your Mind for Success, Volume 3, Primal Drive. That's part of the course. Your next course you'll take is Becoming the Boss. The next course you'll take is How to Never Be Broke Again. The next course you'll take is the $25 Hustle. The 10 Essential Steps to Hustling. The Craigslist Marketing Course. The 24-Hour Startup. The Side Hustler Starter Pack, which gives you access to the storage auction books, the Crippy Craigslist, and all that other stuff. I've included these older webinars to get your mind right. Asking for the money, the Uber sales course. See, what you're going to do is you're going to go through all of this stuff first. There's a pathway, like you go to college, you got to do your freshman year before you do your junior year. So you should go through the hustle mindset, pimp your mind for success first and get these books, then becoming the boss. And then you go through all of this stuff before you get to asking for the money. I'm also going to include the art of holding companies. All that stuff is included in this fat cat secrets, how LLCs make you bank fat cat secrets, fat cat secrets, contracts, how to organize parroting companies, what, why, what, and where, 30 days to 2,500, the original course, 30 days to 2,500, the physical course, and I threw in the child support and disruptive mating. So you've got a money-making curriculum here, all for 99 bucks a month, or you do 200 per month. What I will do is... I will throw in the folks who are doing 200 bucks a month. I will throw in this course. So you'll get that. And once again, you know, if you're getting the basics, you can buy this separately because the courses are arranged to gently take you through a path of how I started, how I got my hands dirty, the things that I did, the things that I put together, the things that I shaped together. And this is what the course will do for you. And you've got 20 months to pay for it. And this is one of the things that I should stress. As you go through the course, within three to five months, you should be making money. If you're going through the courses and you're putting some stuff together, you should be making money. So giving you these courses where once you start making money, you won't even be paying for the courses because the information in the courses you can use to create income. That's the guarantee. If you are actually on these courses, doing what you need to do, taking the courses, executing, putting stuff out there. So you should be making money long before your last payment. There's no one else that's doing this. And I have videos up here on YouTube for free that will make you money. So that's your guarantee. This is the new thing that I'm doing. Plus, there will be some other education. Now, this will not include the dominant male. This will not include that. That's a separate educational track for those who really, really want it. And that will, you know, go to the influence frame, all that stuff's over there. And let's talk about making money during a recession. You start your business and the key to making money during a recession 
is staying out of debt. This is what kills most people. You got an advanced hustle model. There's no reason for you to be in deep debt. And one of the things that, you know, if you have a lot of personal debt, you need to be working on getting rid of that. That is like baggage. You know, before you start investing in a stock market or any type of investment, you should be debt free. So you have more money to apply to your investments versus having to separate your money. You know, you, you're separating your money between 10 different bills and then you're trying to invest in, you know, the 11th section. You know, bigger money invested yields bigger returns. Just facts. So, you know, you could use these courses to create a strong hustle to retire debt. You can use these courses to create extra income out of nothing. Because one of the things that happens with people is everybody wants to chill out, you know, have work-life balance. There's going to be a two to three year period where you, there will not be a work-life balance because you're building that business. And that's hard for a lot of people to understand because there are many people under this false uh, notion that they can build a business, take eight vacations per year, and it's going to work out. I'm here to tell you it's not. For those of you who, you know, like if someone's getting married or you got a family reunion, go. That's like a once in a every now and then type thing. But, you know, roll up your sleeves, be prepared to give up your weekends, be prepared to give up your free time so you can live like no one else lives. So you can set yourself up to have the lifestyle that you want in the future. You know, you may not have it now. I mean, when I was in that boarding house, I, I didn't see this. I didn't see my life being this way. I knew I wanted it to be this way, but I didn't really see it until I actually got into business. And it's going to be hard for you to see until you actually get into business and you get exposed to new people, different people, uh, folks who are attempting to do something big and bold with their life. That's one of the things about starting a business and developing business owners as friends is your perspective drastically expands. Because at the end of this course, you should have a functional business that makes at least a thousand bucks a month. So you're going to pay two grand for the course over time. And, you know, let's say you, 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 it takes you six months to get your hustle going on. This is new income. This is income you didn't have before. So essentially, the sooner that you uh, go through the courses, you get them locked down. And the sooner you get to the part where you're making money, this course is free. This course is free. I want you to think about that. The minute that you start using the information and the training contained in these courses, this course starts to become free because that's new money you never had before. That's new money that you never had before. And I know from the income stats that an extra thousand bucks a month is life changing for most of you. You know, uh, hopefully you'll do more, but that's the minimum. That's the, the ground floor because, you know, I have people who um, took you know, my advice and take this course and this information and apply it to a service business and you will make money much faster. But I want you to think about it. You spend $2,000 over the next 20 months to get this course. And then year one, you make 12000 That's $10,000 to the plus side that you never had. Year two, you make 22000 That's $22,000 that you wouldn't have had year three. Because the thing is, with these courses is once you get in business and once you learn these lessons, they keep giving for the rest of of your life. The stuff that I learned at Renegade, I still use to this very day. So it's, you got to look at it from the expansion of 
what your life will be in the future with the training that's enclosed in these courses. Because, you know, three years from now, you're making an extra thirty, forty thousand dollars a year on top of your job. That's substantial. That's bill paying money. That's mortgage paying money. And that's why I want to get you guys and take you there in a method that you will not freak out because, you know, if I sit here and say that, you know, in a year's time, you guys are going to go from where you are to 100,000, most of you would freak out. It's too much. It's too fast. It's unbelievable because there's levels to getting money. And this course, and this curriculum will take you through the levels. Uh, some people could handle, you know, going from nothing to 100K. Some people can't. Most people can most people freak out. I remember I had a roommate one time that I didn't have a check on me, but I had to cash her rent. And I just gave her cash and she freaked out. It was like 600 bucks. And she was like, oh, I feel like a drug dealer with $600. So people, people are not used to having excess cash because it's so rare. You know, it's not a norm for many people to have, you know, 50 to 100 and I don't recommend keeping millions in the bank, but if you got money coming in so fast that stacks up like that, so be it. But, you know, the most you should keep in the bank is 150, 200, 300K because, you know, money in the bank loses money because it's not working for you. You know, you can leave it in there like maybe a year or two and it'll be okay because you're not going to lose too much. But more than that, you lose a lot of buying power. But what this course will do is teach you, you know, if you get the financial education thing, like for the folks who go for the $200 per month option, you're going to get the financial course. Um, that's life. That's a game changer. So you're going to get used to having money because this is the component. Because once you start your business and you go through this basic financial management course, you'll be set up where you optimize your money already. So when the new money comes in, it doesn't get absorbed in lifestyle creep. Like I had some people start some business and the, the money from the business was paying for daycare and all these other things, which, you know, if you got to do that, you got to do that. But that doesn't help the business grow. So once you go ahead and get your money situated where you can optimize your income, you, you know, you, you got all your bills paid. You got this extra two, three, four, five grand coming in a month. And it actually can come in and stack up because you've optimized your money. You've gotten rid of bills. You know how to have the five checking account blueprint. You're allocating money. You're paying yourself. You, you always have money. Uh, what this course is going to do is you're always going to have money. Like I did this today. Because I'm using a new PayPal account. Well, an old, old PayPal account. And I just went into the bank and got this out the ATM. Thousand bucks. And I will be able to go to that PayPal account tomorrow or the day after and withdraw another thousand bucks. And this is money that I'm putting into my real estate fund to buy a house. Because, you know, they can only allow you a thousand because, you know, I could link up the checking account and just transfer the money, which I probably do. But it's just nice going to the ATM, putting that ATM card in there and hearing that. <laughs> and, you know, then go ahead and put it in the bank because I, I, I probably as that account grows. I'm probably going to have to, you know, set up the checking account and transfer the money because it will be too large for cash deposits. But this is what I'm talking about. All my bills are paid. I don't have any credit card debt. I got extra money coming in that I can put into an account to put into investments of assets. And that's where I want you to be. And that's what this course will do for you. Because it's a, look at the long term. Uh, one of the things that's a big problem is we have a lot of people who have short term thinking. I need money now because I'm in pain right now. I got to pay rent. I got to pay child support. I need that money right now. 
And as long as you're in that right now situation, you're never going to change your financial life. You're never going to be in a situation where you can stack money because you have no financial discipline. There should be no reason that you're in a situation where you need money right now. You're mishandling money. You're mistreating money. You don't respect money. And this is why you don't have any. Because, you know, essentially you want to have money on your credit card, on you, and in the bank. You want to have money three places because this is what's funny about money. Money attracts more money. So if you're in a situation where you don't have no money, you have no money to attract any more money. And, you know, I'm speaking from experience. I used to be the person who used to go to the pawn shop, did the title pawn loan thing, and actually borrowed money from friends because I was so broke. I had no personal discipline, no financial discipline. I was just living for the moment. And you got to get out of that because, you know, going through these courses, let me show you what this will do for you. All right, so how to never be broke again. This is a very important co course, and it's early in the $25 hustle because essentially what's happening is I'm bringing you guys along in baby steps. I know that mentally, you know, it, it sounds nice to win the lottery and, you know, go from nothing to millions of dollars. But why lottery winners broke after so many years? Because they don't know how to handle money. You know, I, I mean, it, it's, it's ridiculous. Like someone wins $150 million and then they're in trouble. You know what $150 million will do? You can take $100 million, buy commercial real estate, and blow $50 million and never be broke again a day in your life. You'll have monthly reoccurring revenue. Yet these folks, they see money as, I got $150 million. I don't need to do anything else. When that type of money dictates that you do something else. Because if you just took $100 million and parked it in apartment complexes, you probably get three Probably, you know, one to three million, depending on how you buy it, per month in reoccurring revenue. One to three million per month. So after, you know, three or four years, you've got your principal back. Now you, you now, now, now they're just a cash cow. And, you know, we'll be talking about this for those people who choose the um, $200 per month option. I'm going to have a lot of classes about money, what to do with money, how to do money. Once again, you're not getting into the dominant male stuff. Those are going to be separate educational tracks. Because one of the things is this is for people who want to change their lives. So, you know, becoming a boss, how to never be broke again, the 25 hour hustle, the 10 essential steps of hustling, the Craigslist marketing course. That will do so much for you. It really will. The side hustler starter pack. So this gives you a lot here, right here. How to start an online business for 500. Pimp and Craigslist for Fun and Profit, Hustling 105, How to Start Your Business as Fast as Possible, 10 Essential Steps to Hustling Now in the Future, How to Get a Secure Credit, you know, just stuff for people who are in, who are on the fringes of finances, who, who've never really had the proper financial education. And, you know, if you are Broke Dick Danny, the Craigslist Marketing Course, a 24-hour startup. All this is beginner rookie stuff. And as you go through the course, because when you get here, this is when things get more real. And then the Art of Holding Company, Fat Cat Secrets, you get all of that. Then 30 days to 2,500 because 
when you're getting into, when you hit this juncture, you should be making a thousand or more a month when you get here. So once you've got to that level, then, you know, there, there will be some people who will take this course and get to 10, 15, 20 K per month within a year. Cause there are some people who just get it, who understand. And there are some people who are going to, you know, cause everybody learns at their own pace. And there are going to be some people, it's going to take them a year to get up to $1,000 per month. But if you're making 25, 30 K a year, and you create your own business making a thousand dollars a month, that's twelve thousand. That's thirty percent of your income. Well, actually, if you're making twenty-five, that's fifty percent of your income. That's a game changer. So I got all this stuff in here. And what I want you guys to do is to go through the course the way it was intended. Because some people will like jump around, like, I don't need this. Understand, this is the process that I went through to get where I'm at. I went through the resale. I went through the company formation. I went through all this other stuff. And I'm taking you through these courses through the same journey that I went through. And you may skip around and you may short circuit yourself because lessons that were learned from the storage auction business help me with my internet business. Because Business knowledge builds upon itself. And the more data points, the more information you have, the more that it's going to stand out, the more that you're going to be able to accomplish, the more resources you will have at your hands. Because once again, this is the pathway that I took. This is the only way I know how to do it. I don't, I don't know how to do anything else. So you've got that. And, like, you know, once again, for those who opt to, um, let's see, we'll make a change. Because you're not getting the disruptive mail stuff. So I need to go ahead and get that out of there because the disruptive mail stuff, you know, because what I will do for people who buy disruptive mail stuff, I will give those guys discounts for this stuff because, you know, part of being a dominant, competent man is having your own economics. And this is something I have been stressing for years. And a lot of people just don't get it, don't want to get it, want to keep hoping and believing that they will be empowered by doing what they're doing, and it's just not going to happen. So there, there's a lot here. So let's get rid of that. And this is Hustler Undergrad. All right. So there we have it. And for those of you who want to get past this because, you know, let's see. You can buy this package all at once and save a G and get this if you buy this. Or if you don't want all that and you just want the holding company stuff, you can get that because I'm about to change the price of the holding company stuff. So, and I'm going to make some more changes. 
because essentially, like I said, you know, I've been talking about we were about to get into some massive educational training. And one of the things that I'm going to do for the people who bought the first version of H undergrad, they're going to get all of the monthly trainings because uh, that's something I used to do and I've gotten away from that. So we're going to go back to that. We'll be covering various topics about starting businesses, making money, and, you know, so you'll be able to get this, but your best, the most bang for your buck will be the $200 option. And essentially, this is how this works. Once you go ahead and you sign up, give me 24 hours to add you to your respective course and set your password and everything. So, and one of the things is, you know, um, probably, you know, there will be one major educational thing once a month. I realized I was rolling too fast for you guys. You know, it's like, bam, here's an idea. Let's do it today. And that didn't give people enough time to reserve that space. So I'm going to give y'all like two or three weeks notice of what's going to happen and how it's going to happen and things we're going to talk about. So this is how you're going to make money in a recession. Because the thing is, last recession, I made more money. And currently, we're in a recession. And I'm making, you know, my income has gone up because people are in a situation where they need the knowledge and the training to start a business. And that's what you're going to get here. You can start a business or an advanced hustle model. An advanced hustle model is where you take, like, say, painting and you turn that into a business or you take haul offs or you take cutting grass or this will help you with all of that because essentially once you get through this you'll be ready because you know essentially once you're making money because you can start a business and make money for a few months and then set up your holding company and operating structure this is something you know unless you know for sure that you're going to get into this this is one of the things that you can do to set that up because essentially how good would it feel to have two three thousand dollars in the bank that you can use for your holding company expenses uh, this is one of the bigger issues is people are like i don't have enough money you're, you're not really being active you're not uh, setting yourself up properly because you're not doing anything. Sitting here watching YouTube videos is good, but not taking action is bad. And what these courses are going to do are going to prompt you to take action. They're going to prompt you to get busy. So once again, this is how you get in. Go right up there, you know, pick out if you're going to take Hustler Grad Premium or you're going to take Hustler Undergrad Basic. It includes the purchasing, you know, because you're, you're having access to all these courses. So it's, it's just like a car contract, a, a car loan. You have the car even though you haven't paid for it. So just be aware of that because you can go in here and take these courses at your time or and i recommend that you set up a training schedule where every day that you go through some course work and every day you apply the principles that are in these courses because that's how you're going to make faster progress by having the structure of a schedule just like every saturday i'm gonna sit here for four or five hours if that's all you got, that's all you got, but that's not optimum. The optimum thing would be to spend five to seven days a week on these courses, 
taking it a little bit in and actually go over these courses three to four times. Because each time you go over it, you're going to hear something that you did not hear the first time. So this is one of the things. And probably for people who get the hustler grad option after your first few payments, your first payment, I'm going to put you in the basic financial course and then I'm going to put you in some of these other courses as a thank you. But I'll do that per month. And, you know, just once again, you're, you're not going to get into the dominant male stuff or the edu these education track that's over here. And I've said that three times because I know people will ask because people are like, because, you know, essentially, you know, we, we got women over here who, who want nothing to do with the dominant male, which is cool. But they're looking for the education that's in H undergrad. So here's the deal. And once again, give me 24 hours or less to add you, to set you up, and I'll do that. And we'll be rocking and rolling. Because the thing is, success is a process that leaves clues. And if you tweak a few things in your life each day, you'll get closer and closer to success. You'll get closer and closer to the life that you want. You'll get closer and closer to achieving the things that you want. You will get that Wi-Fi bread. You will live a better life. And rich folks, you know, God willing, tend to typically live longer than poor folks. I, I see it all the time. You know, I think Mellon lived to be 107. You know, the dude had like three liver transplants. They kept that old guy alive. But, you know, once again, in, in my video, you're getting older and poorer Let's say you're you're 40 something and you get on this track, you get older and you get richer. Because typically the average man income peaks around 45. Then it starts going down, 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 down. By employing and doing this, your income can go up. You can make more money the older you get because you're you're making yourself more valuable. You're making yourself a producer, an asset to society, because that's what happens when you start a business. You become a problem solver on a at scale. You're solving multitude people's problem. You start a restaurant. You're solving the problem of people being hungry. You start an apparel company. You're solving the problem of people having something to wear. You start an education company. You're educating people who need your education. So. Starting a business makes you a massive problem solver at scale. And there's intrinsic value to that. And there's so many rewards. You know, when I go through the comments and I'll see someone because of this dude, this is why I started my service business and I'm making $1,500 to $2,000 a month. That's real. That's real people getting real results. And if you watch this channel and you've attended the live streams, you have seen multitude of people making that Wi-Fi bread. And, you know, like, like what I like to call the 5%. Because there, I don't know what it is with the average person that unless something bad happens, most people just don't move unless something really bad happens. And maybe this was what happened to me. I had all types of misery in my life. I had, you know, I was living in a crackhead boarding house. I was living in the West End, a bad neighborhood, a lot of pain just living. And I don't recall ever being like super happy. I had some good moments in the hood, but not like my life today, where I'm always happy, where I'm always looking forward to stuff, where I'm always positive. And it, this is success begets positivity. So the more success you have in your life, the more positive you'll be. And this is a good thing. <clears throat> and also, if you have kids, and let's talk about this, you can teach them the stuff that you learned. So you can spend that $2,000 or $4,000 
in the next 20 months or you, well, like 6,000, you can spend that money now. And that money could inform your kids how to make money when they're adults. So this small investment is really small when you look at it from that level that you have increased your income. Now you're teaching your kids how to set up themselves where their income. So you can spend that $2,000 or $6,000 now, and we could be talking about hundreds of thousands of dollars over the years for you and your kids, hundreds of thousands of dollars. Over time, your kids will never be poor. Your kids will never have to work a job they don't want to work. Think about that as a parent, that you can give your kid that kind of legacy. Think about how you can set that up. Think about how you can empower them to be positive, productive people. Think about that. Because once again, you know, you, you, you're, nowhere else is you getting this where you can go ahead and do this like a car loan where you have access to the information and you pay for it over time and you know 99 bucks a month that's most people can do that I ain't trying to break your pockets I'm not trying to stick you up with a gun so go ahead and get in this and I will see you guys later because we're about to do a lot of educational training, a lot of stuff is coming your way, and just be prepared for it. So with that, I'll see you guys later. We're about to get a little rugged. We're going to start some stuff because this course, and let me tell you how it's going to go. I'm going to add a little bit each day. There will be the main groups and there will be action items for you to do each day. Success doesn't take any days off. Why should you? Where are you going to take a day off from? Do you take a day off from breathing? Do you take a day off from your heart beating? Do you take a day off from eating? Well, some of us do. Do you take a day off from your hair growing? Do you take a day off from your nails growing? This stuff always is going on. Roughly, it's going to take you 15 minutes a day to complete the exercises as we move forward. Just letting you know. Because, once again, I'm still on that recession tip. Uh, the Donald is doing a lot of stuff that's distracting. Because right now, you hear all this stuff. We want to investigate the FBI because they're investigating me, right? But the Supreme Court just handed down a decision where you cannot assemble and form unions. Wait a minute. Look at this over here. And while we do this over here, Russia, Russia, pay for play, money laundering, nepotism, Russia, Russia. So you are you over here looking at this hand. This hand is stabbing your economic future in the back. But, you know, some of you voted for him. And I think, well, I know you're going to live to regret doing so. But anywho. Anyone has any questions about zero to a million dollars? Yes, this is all about this course. If you are interested, this is where you want to be. So I'm going to close this. Well, no, I might, I might be back up in there. I don't know because you got to be careful when you use copyright material because YouTube may like delete the whole soundtrack. So we don't want that. Let me raise up this chat. Because we, I'm like, the moderators be on y'all. Appreciate y'all. Let's see what we got going on here. All right. <laughs> Sharpening my knife, charlatan. Josh Barr reporting to duty. Cool, cool, cool. Thank you, all of my moderators. Be real. Big G was right. You have to start an LLC and protect yourself. A friend of mine just got divorced. Judge cleaned him out. Child support, 20 years of, ah, half, ah, child support, 20 years of alimony, half his pension, and half of his annuity, woo, woo, oh my, oh, man, he got raped, 
Good Lord, be real. Is he is he still breathing? Good Lord. Can he sit down? Good Lord. Do, do, do. All right. All right. <laughs> the moderators ain't playing. Thank you, Stefan, for the $20 super chat. Go ahead. You, you're you free to super chat. Ain't nobody holding you. You can just hit that little dollar sign that's like at the bottom of the chat and uh, throw some money up in the air. All right. <laughs> Better than coffee and Red Bull. Thank you, Be Real. Good Lord, this getting hot up in here. A person has to go to their foundational seat by their parents or guardians that will that will that cognitive dissonance will seek in and will rebel. Pretty much. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Oh, because see, this is the thing. And one of the reasons I have to break it, because a lot of you who've been here for a few years, you know the deal. You know you could be successful. You know white people will buy from you. Asian people will buy from you. Mexicans will buy from you. You know that because you got businesses and you're feeling that. But there's still this self-limiting belief, you know, I'm black and ain't nobody going to buy nothing from me because I'm black. Bullshit. <laughs> Stop the excuses. All right, let's see what's going on. Ganja, my job is nepotism galore. It's a federal government job. This is what's going to happen. And this recession comes, even the government is going to shed jobs. And this is going to be problematic for that nepotism crew. 89, Dr. Funk, I just saw on the news 15 minutes ago about the Supreme Court deal. Yep. You're not going to be able to form a union. This is part of the reasons that wages have not increased purportedly because we have this raging job market, but people still have two and three jobs. People not feeling real appreciation in their paycheck. It's very interesting. Pamela C. all day long. I know it, day nine, Dr. Funk. Since the reality, besides your courses, do you know the, the best books for learning how to build an LLC and different business structures? Excellent question. I knew that was going to be asked, and I have a hell of an answer. There are a lot of books out there, but here's the real deal. Remember when I said that I read 4,000 books in my lifetime, 4,000 plus? You can read the same book that I read. And because you don't have all this knowledge and these data points all up in your mind, you're not going to get the same results that I did. Because there are many of you who are reading these books that I recommend. And I'll continue to recommend some more books. But unless you have the life experience, the data points, and the execution, reading the book, you're going to yield a totally separate, totally different set of results. So that's what I got for you. Pretty much, Stefan. This guy needs to earn his money under a 10-foot table. See, he's in trouble. Um, what he will have to do, and we'll talk about that after I go through these comments. Charlotte, ain't nobody going to is always said by someone who's never started or tried. Amen, Charlatan. Amen. <laughs> we have a black princess, so yes, we could do anything. All right. Uh, let's take um, Be Real's friend. What he needs to do now, because essentially they have sunk the legal teeth into him, is he needs to create an LLC. He needs to find some kind of business model that he can create so he can protect whatever money he can earn. Because half his annuity, half his retirement, that's gone. That's law. That, that's it. He, it's, it's, a, it's a done deal. But he's got to create new income, new revenues, and new business that she don't know about. 
I mean, this is what I'm talking about. I had a similar situation, except I didn't have the half of the uh, pension because I didn't have a pension and annuity and spousal support. And she didn't get that. But in the alimony, oh, my God. Part of this is to keep, prevent him from ever marrying again and producing more offspring. Seriously. That's why part of this onerous judgment, because if, you know, if she can find a job, she should be able to find a job. But once again, the courts treat women like children, like, oh, let me pat you on the head. Oh, little girl, you can't find a job. Oh, bad man, bad man. We're going to give her, you know what? We're going to give her, your money to her. And if you don't have that money, you're going to jail. Yet she can be completely destitute and no one's talking about putting her in jail for not having money to support those kids but your black ass or white ass or yellow ass or mexican ass whatever color you are if you don't have that money we're gonna put you in jail brah that's what i'm saying it's a, it's rough out there it's rough out here in these legal streets so part of the thing is what we're going to do in this course is work on stuff that mom and dad that shouldn't have. And I know it's going to sound like overly simplistic in the beginning. Then it's going to get very, very rough. But you're going to have to do certain behaviors, exhibit certain behaviors for a prolonged time to regurgitate your upbringing. Many of you, your mom, you know, even those of you who had good mothers and good fathers, they couldn't teach you what they didn't know. And that's like, you know, if your mom and dad loved you, you felt the love and you're close to them to this day. Awesome. They still didn't know a lot about money. That's just the truth of the matter. <laughs> Let's see. Half, Eddie. Half. I know, right? It also means she's never going to marry again. If she remain, if she marries, the alimony goes away. Well, yeah, possibly depends on how much the alimony is and depends on what the child Because see. The thing is, even if she remarries again, she's getting his retirement unless he goes to court and challenge it like someone put in there. Yeah, he can go to appeal this. But the fact that they gave her tells me that she doesn't work and they have like three or four kids. You know, you can correct me on that. Be real. I assume it was nasty, but here's the thing. We're going to go on this journey because a lot of people are like, hey, Glennon, what do you do? Uh, Glennon, what is your written goals for the day? You can't do what I am doing unless you have done what I have done. I didn't just drop out the sky with this knowledge, like parachute into the Hustleville and start hustling. No, 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 no. I took a lot of L's. I took a ton of L's, a lot of L's. And I know a lot of you are trying to like to avoid those L's, but it's better to take a little baby L than to take this big L like Be Real's friend just did. That is crippling. Unless he's got some serious hustle juice. Yeah, that was kind of crazy. But I'm not going to be here too long because, uh, you know, just to kind of give you a heads up on the schedule. What we're going to be doing is there might be something for disrupted mail in the morning, but I'm going to start taking the days to go in and start creating this course and fixing old courses and adding more to the Hustler LLC. So every day for, I don't know, months. I'm going to be creating new training, creating new content. And it's going to be very, very different than what was there before because I'm going to take my time and I'm going to do it right because I ain't going to let you savages rush me. Glenn, Glenn, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Her, her. We ain't doing that because if you're doing the exercises, you're not going to be able to go that fast anyway. And it's designed that way because like, all right, I lost about 50 pounds, but I didn't lose 50 pounds in six months. I didn't lose 50 pounds in a year. I lost 50 pounds in about two and a half years. And that's the reason I've been able to keep it off because I've been doing it slowly. Now I'm getting get aggressive and my goal is to lose another 15. 
I read this book that the body holds on. Like, say you weigh 250 and you've been 250, 260 for years. Your body is desperately trying to hold on to that weight. That's why it's so hard to lose. That's why you got to lose it, keep it off, lose some more, keep it off, lose some more, and keep it off. But everybody trying to look good for the summer and forget the rest of their fucking life. <laughs> I'm in this for the, the long haul because um, now I'm wearing some shirts, extra large. I've come out of the 2X. Underwear from double X to large. Um, just I feel better. I move better. So this is a lifestyle change that took a long time. And I'm telling you that if you want permanent and substantial change, it's going to take some time. I mean, for some of you, it's going to take a long time. For some of you, it's not going to take a long time. I don't know how long it's going to take you. But remember Sally Mae Jones, Lady Made Me Cut That Grass, she used to have the saying, if you live long enough, one day you're going to be old. This life, this clock of life is steadily ticking. So if you don't really dig in, and I've seen it in the comments, like, man, I wish I had listened to you two years ago. Man, I wish I had listened to you three years ago. This, there's a reason this channel has been around eight years and will be going on this ninth year in August. Everybody that's not ready for the message, I'm, I'm cool with that. I cannot make you drink the water. I can just point to you like, there's water there. And it's good, and it's cool, and it's refreshing. I could do that. Uh, let's see where we are. <laughs> the kids are in college. Whoa, this was a very nasty, contentious divorce. She stuck him for his paper. So that means the child support is going to end in a few years. That's good. Uh, since we're out of the way, I see it. Many laborers, professionals such as medical doctors and engineers are going the way of nurses and lawyers. A sure job for life is obsolete. I got a friend who's been a doctor 15 years and he complains about it. He loves being a doctor. He loves helping people. But he says he talks to old doctors and they say it ain't nothing like it used to be. You don't get the respect. You don't get the courtesy and you don't get the money. So, yeah, that's coming. The original lady pimp, this may be a dumb question, but can a divorce decree be contested? Uh, can he plead financial hardship? Well, based upon what Be Real said, he ain't poor in his tax records because they get your tax records. So he can't plead hard financial hardship, but he can contest an appeal. Each time you talk about divorce, I'm so grateful my divorce is uncontested. Milton Cox, yes, every course is 50% off, but you have to spend $750 to get the lifetime access to Disruptive Mail, or you can just go ahead and get Disruptive Mail direct. I tell you. Man, this is just like, I wonder why these people come in here just to waste their time, because the moderator too, y'all are like, Luke Skywalker with the lightsaber. Y'all cutting them off at the ankles. That was like, um, I think that was Obi-Wan Kenobi that cut off Anakin's arms and legs. Um, Milton Cox, the code is, where do you get that? The code is, I am the boss. And let me just go in here. Yeah, that weekend hustle school, that was like a long time ago. That was a long time ago. Let me get in here real quick. I know that, yeah, it's been, I am the boss. Actually, I need to add more numbers to this. Let's see. Let me go in here. Coupons. Just checking. Yep, the coupon is I am the boss. That we can... Oh, okay. All right. I, I, you know, my bad. I see what you're saying. Uh, he's trying to appeal. He tried. Yeah, the weekend hustle school, I think I turned that off, so you can't buy that. 
uh, be real. He's trying to appeal. He tried to hide a house down south in his father's name. She's about to get that too. Whew. Honey Bunny is zero to one million a course of series. It is a course. It's probably going to be when I'm done with it. It's probably going to be right at six hours, maybe seven hours. If it goes beyond that, I'll let you know. Yeah, that's a good question, uh, Ganji88. I want you to think of how can I say this? Because I didn't have time to do the bones. The bones will be up in there tonight, so you'll be able to see the bones. Um, and then I'm going to start dropping content in the morning. I want you to think of like a high school course where you go in and you have subject matter, you have to study, and you have to do stuff. It's going to be like that. This is a mindset course. There's going to be a lot of really interesting stuff in there. I'm going to put the diving board exercise back in there because a lot of people want that, plus some more exercises. Oh, yeah. Let me write that down, make sure I remember that because a lot of people don't know about that because that's a test of where your mindset is. So we're going to diving board. Exercise plus others. It's going to be wild. It's going to be very, very wild. So let's see, where are we with this? Because I am not going to be here too long. Any more questions? Because I'll drop a little bit more information about the course tomorrow after I create the first legs of content. Now, I got some help. So we're going to be doing this course. We're going to be doing Get a Big Dick. And we're going to be doing stuff in disruptive mail because one of the things I want to do is put together certain things versus going too far down the road. And y'all be like, I don't really like that. I have a general sense of what you want because, you know, as we go through, I'll be like, okay, is this cool? Is this not cool? So we're not just going to build something that people don't want. Honey, buddy, I'm here for the mindset courses. It all starts in the mind. Yes, it does. Uh, this dude bakes. Um, this dude bakes. Uh, I don't know if you heard this, but what you have to do is go to disruptivemail.org. I had a problem with disruptivemailprep.com where I still can't get into the site. I hadn't had time to scream at them, but I have to create another course and another site on another platform. So I don't think you know that you have to go there, put in your name and email address, sign up for it. And then I will add you to the course. I think that's where you are. Dang, D. Hectrix, the screwing you get for the screwing you got. <laughs> Any more questions <laughs> about zero to me? No. And the reason I named this course is that's my story. I was living in a boarding house. I didn't have no money. And it didn't really turn around until I developed a better mindset. I worked two jobs. I worked three jobs. And I was still poor. But because I sat down and thought, looked at the whole situation, made an analysis, came up with a plan and executed, I got a job at Renecrate. Still had that hustler, hustler mindset. Then I moved to Panel Systems Unlimited. Then I moved to Business Environments. Then I moved to my own company. And I haven't had a job since. Rent a crate, panel systems, business environments. See, three jobs before I leapt off into my own thing. No, no, this dude bakes. You actually have to sign up. I, I, I haven't, because th there's just too many of y'all for me to be signing you up and adding you and then emailing you. That's just too much work. The original Lady Pip. Wasn't it Johnny Taylor that said it's cheaper to keep her? <laughs> I don't know about that because there's a mental cost of being with some people. Uh, I can honestly say that I probably would have went crazy if I stayed with my wife. Even though she divorced me just the way that she is. Notice I said present tense is. 
Woo. And you know what's funny? I know she watches these videos. I got two of my exes watching these videos. And you know what I what I continue to do? I continue to rise and rise and rise and rise and rise. I go higher. I get better. And I hadn't seen pictures of either one of them. But I got a feeling I look younger than they do because I don't have that stressful life that they do. And you know what? I feel, I feel sad for both of them. I feel... I pity them. I really do because it didn't have to go down that way. But both of them tried to get me. One of them, well, yeah, she did fuck me over. And she fucked me over royally for years. The other one, but see, the first one prepared me for the second one. Because I already knew, because all of the blinders were off, like this woman that you lay in bed with and have children with, this sweet little woman, she could turn into a viper on you just like that. So I already knew what could happen, and it did. And I was just like, Droom. with my lightsaber, parry, thrust, droom, 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 droom. and I didn't get stuck. I got all my body parts, all my digits and stuff. I didn't get stuck. But she got stuck, the second one. She's the one that has this very harsh life because, see, this is something else, and I know this from having kids. When their kids are like little babies, that baby stage, Every woman wants to sniff the baby, hold the baby, do all of this stuff. But when they get around two and a half, three, start asking questions, and start to get their that attitude, they ain't as fun as they used to be when they're a little baby and where you can just put them somewhere and they stay there until you come back. They ain't like that. Bigger, asking questions like, where's dad? Who's my daddy? And you got to lie or actually become a woman of character. <laughs> And tell her the truth. Madison, I didn't really want him to be your father because he didn't want me. So you got screwed out of a father because he didn't want me. Sorry. It's going to be a very interesting conversation in a few years. It really is. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Good Lord. Oh, 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 yeah. I, sh yeah, he, um, she came at him with venom and fangs. Wow. Charlotte, that peace of mind is worth a lot. <laughs> it's not cheaper to keep her anymore. Pretty much, CC. <laughs> Real rest in peace to your friend. He has to hold that L. <laughs> wow. Uh, Mike Rowland, learning that now. No price on peace of mind. Good Lord. It says it doesn't recognize the email. Well, that sounds like your email is already in the system. Well, what I'm going to do is pick a day this week. And I'm not giving out the email because I don't want to have people like, hey, did you look at my email? I'm probably going to do Friday. It's like a customer service day to handle these issues. So just wait for that. I'm not going to forget either because it's on the calendar. Good Lord, be real. He just silly. Uh, good question. I joined Hustle Kung Fu with my LinkedIn account. LinkedIn, but used the direct email because of the beach. Joshua Hill, do you think it's easier to become a multimillionaire today versus back in the old days? Because I often read the stories of how certain families became wealthy on very little starting capital. 
I'm going to say with the advent of technology that is easier today to become a millionaire than ever before, you've got 18, 19, 20-year-old kids who are multimillionaires. Now, what happened back in the day was these people had no competition. If people knew, like Warren Buffett, that you know when you're 13 years old, you can buy some stock. If people really knew that and understood, there had been more competition. Uh, GE, they didn't have any competition. Now they got competition. Look at their stock price. So I would say today is easier than ever. All right, but we'll work that out because Friday will be customer service day. I got to get content going. So let's go ahead, make sure that I, and I'll do it live. How's that? Customer service. And we'll fix all issues in real time and stuff like that. Stream. Yeah, I like that. So we'll do that. Ganja, exactly. Information asymmetry caused some people to get rich back then. Where now, once again, there's more information. Everybody knows everything. Everybody can research everything. And you got to actually execute. Because the still thing is, let's say Hustler G over here knows what you know. But Hustler G is a little lazy. You know, he'll hustle for about 30 hours a week. And he'll, like, kick back. Then you got Hustler H over here who is not as smart is Hustler G, but Hustler H put in 80 fucking hours a week. Guess who's going to win that race? <laughs> Good Lord, that's crazy. Yeah, we'll talk about all that dating and stuff at Disruptive Mail because uh, there's some serious topics coming that way this week. Uh, next stream will be tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to do it this morning because, like I said, I'm trying to find a happy balance between putting out content and creating training because it all comes from the same place. So I'm getting stronger because I actually did, like yesterday was a monster day. I did four streams, and I did it before 7 o'clock. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. And I, the thing is I, I came up with new concepts. So the next stream will be tomorrow. There will not, I'm not going to be doing two streams. Uh, Sundays, I'm probably going to do four streams because I feel that's a good way to start the week off because Sunday's a work day. Do two streams in the morning, do two in the evening, and then I'm, I don't know because I did a little test with Friday and Saturday. Uh, there still might be streams Friday and Saturday, but I'm not sure because I'm probably going to do it again this week just to make sure my testing is on point, and we'll see. All right, no more questions. And like I said, I'll be talking about this a little bit more. And also, as you can see, I'm like in front of you versus looking like this. Because I've been looking like this because the computer used to be here that I started to get like a little strain on this trap, right? And I was like, wait a minute. So now I got the laptop where I can look straight ahead and I look down and this is much better. Okay, Sundays are great. Cool. Because, yeah, I like that flow of Sundays because, you know, people, Sunday for most people is a work day. They don't stay out too late. They do their clothes, their meal preps. They, they, that's their day, right? And that's a good day to kick back. So Sundays will be like the power day to get the week started. And I'm probably going to do Friday and Saturday this week just to test, just to see where that puts me because we're going into the summer and traditionally – Views drop during the summer, but I'm going to try to do some hustler kung fu magic to see if I can actually grow my channel during the summer versus it going down. And what's interesting, you know, since y'all want to geek out with me, is this channel has grown this month and I've taken off the paid traffic. Because it's arcing up ever so slowly. So I'm doing some right. <laughs> the judge executed game flawlessly. Uh, Brandon, I don't know. It depends on you. Depends on who you are. Depends on your connects. All right, I'm about to go. Um, like I said, this is it for the day. There are no more streams today, but there will be. Yeah, there'll be two tomorrow. Now.
for those of you who are interested in zero to one million, how to go from nothing to getting rich. Oh, I need to explain that. I am rich, but I'm not wealthy. But this is the progression. You must go from whatever you're doing to getting rich and rich gives you the ability to get wealthy because I don't have enough assets because, you know, I crunched the numbers. I could probably retire and get 75000 a year. They ain't enough. They ain't enough at all. They, they ain't enough at all. That's not what I'm like. No, 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 no. So I kind of said, you know what? Let's see. What if we go ahead, start a new company, grow it over time, let it go through its revisions because, you know, new companies, because you, you have a certain set of assumptions that you think are going to happen. But real life has a way of going like, ha ha, that was very silly. And whether that for a few years, then create this company, get it up and running about 15 years, then hand it over to my daughter, then collect checks. That That's kind of the plan. I don't know how it's going to work, but that's kind of the plan. Uh, the collaborations. That definitely, that gets new subscribers, but last time I happened, my views did not go up. But also, I've changed the content. If you notice, I've turned the ads off. I've changed the content because I'm doing what I really want to do because, um, you know, YouTube was really, really interesting. Jimmy Choo, just stop. That'll never, well, let me say, don't, don't ever say never. Don't never say never. That, that's kind of crazy. That that's uh whoo that's very interesting. I shouldn't be surprised. I shouldn't be surprised. But anyway, in closing, if you want to be part of zero to a million, the mindset course is not a sales course, it's not a marketing course, it's a mindset course, and it's gonna blow your mind with the stuff I'm gonna put in there. Go below, you can use the coupon, it's three hundred bucks, you can get it for one fifty and Seriously, it's going to blow your mind. You thought 20, 30 days to 2,500 was good? This will be awesome. No, you got a little time. I'm going to probably be running this promo all week. You got a little time. Uh, Eric, when YouTuber said he went to VidCom and his numbers went up like crazy. You think that's on purpose? Uh, I, no, I think he went to VidCon, met some people, got some collabs, and that's why his numbers went up. Worse, they say it's offensive to single moms and gays. What? That's crazy talk. Pretty much. Okay, so links below the video. You go there. There are no courses there. There's nothing there, but it gives you an explanation of what you're going to get. Plus, tomorrow, I'm going to put modules like what's going to be in module A, what's going to be in module B, what's going to be in module C. Because one of the things is since I have um, been working out, my energy level has gone really high and I've been very productive. Now I'm bringing back a lot of the old school methodologies that I used to do to stay consistent and to create this course. Coupon not working. Hold on. <laughs> what? Let's see. Let me get in here. Let me look. All right. Let's just test this. And let's see. I am the boss. That should be the coupon. Josh Barr, could you bring back scripted days? Ha 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 ha. I am going to be part of this new course. It's going to be scripted days times 1,000. That's going to be in the new course. So I'm just letting you know. All right. So um, you know what? I'm going to know. Let's see. Because I, I have a feeling I changed that. You know what I'm going to do? All right, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because if a lot of people are having a problem with this, so what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of this coupon. 
Because it ain't working. Come on, coupon. Come on, come on, come on. So we're going to delete the coupon. There we go. So there's no coupon. And then we're going to go to the course. It should be up. Here we go. And we're going to change the price to 150. Still having the middleman. 150. There is no coupon now. So you should be able to go ahead and jump in and get this at 150. So I'm going to go ahead and make these changes down here. Come on, baby. So early bear special, just get rid of that. $150 by now. And we're going to get rid of this coupon language. All right. So that should be effortlessly. And probably what I'll do Friday is some more live financial wizardry. Uh, Jesus three, be real. What Chris Rock said in his comedy show: Shaq is rich. The guy who signs his check is wealthy. Now Shaq's wealthy. I, I disagree with Chris. Disagree with a lot of stuff Chris says. Shaq is wealthy. All right, look, you know, before I go, let, let's let's just even let's talk about this. If you, because I don't have this, but if you can get ten million dollars, right? Ten million in cash assets, whatever. Ten million and pull off four to five percent of that year. Let's just say five percent. That's five hundred thousand dollars a year passive income with your ten million still intact. That, my friends, is wealthy. You got 10 million in assets that are caking you off 500K a year in passive income. I'm kind of like halfway there, but I'm not really there because it's the stuff I did. So I got to, no, I'm not even halfway there. I mean, best tops is probably 120, and that's pushing it. And everything's got to go right. And what do we know here at Hustlers Kung Fu? Everything ain't going to go right. So while I'm still relatively young in the tooth, I'm only 51, I can work another 15, 16 years. No problem. And that's what I plan on doing. Oh, and also, next month we're going to do another challenge. It's going to be very different. We're going to keep it at 10K, though, because I saw a lot of people struggle with that. A lot of people struggle. Like they did the 2K challenge, knocked that out the ballpark, but a lot of people struggle with 10K. So we're going to talk about that. But that's that's awesome stadium because there are exactly six more days in the 10K challenge. Oh, Erica Williams. Shaq has a net worth of $400 million plus countless endorsements. He didn't even touch his. Yeah, Shaq is rich. Like I said, Chris Rock, uh, he got more things wrong than his marriage. Yeah, I'm not like a big fan of Chris Rock. So there you go. All right, so be back tomorrow, maybe in the morning. Once again, I'm going to work this out. But um, zero to one million is going to have more content tomorrow, and it's going to have the modules and all those bones. So I got to go. I got to work on that. I got to write a piece tonight. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Go below, get it. I changed it so you don't have to use a coupon. You can just go ahead and buy straight. So with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Be sure to subscribe, like, comment, and super chat that.